Well, a very good evening to you wherever you are. I do hope that you can join me in appreciating this truly beautiful evening. A night that is absolutely ideal for a game of football. The scenes here really are something, a beautiful picture under the floodlights. Traffic and transport round here, not the kindest. But regardless of that, the fans have found a way of getting here. There is a sense of theatre and the decibel levels are rising. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. The national anthem of Argentina rings out. The juice is flowing, and now this. suggests it's going to be a 4-5-1 formation, Jim. Well, this centre, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protected layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter-attacks if you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot. It can have a, a devastating effect, actually, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. So it's down to business here. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, I'm not sure that words can do this fella justice, Peter. Lionel Messi is one of the, the all-time greats, that's for sure. A fantastic dribbler with a killer eye for a pass and obviously a lethal finisher too. Everyone knows what he's capable of, but stopping him's a, a very different match. It's Di Maria! That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Well, if he truly fancies his chances from here, he's going to need the best of the best. Oh, the ball's run loose here. Di Maria's still a great lead. Oh, she's needed a better contact. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Gets his pass away. He's through here. And Di Maria! Oh, surely that deserved better. The timing of the pass and run was exquisite. to see how long they can sustain this and, and suppress those wide opposition players. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. 
Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Anticipated. And it's Messi. And Messi! It's there! They're level, level in a trice! Well, going behind has simply triggered a collective determination to hit back, and they merit nothing less. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, for me, you can't fault the keeper there. The effort went in at the widest possible point off the upright. Nothing he could do. Argentina at the equaliser and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. De Paul. Gonzalez. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Gonzalez. Got a shot away. Just five minutes left until the break. Right, a poor pass, too easily intercepted. Oh, that's a key interception. Into stoppage time, very little left on it. Made up towards the front line. And it's the goalkeepers to play. And the first half is done. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. That's the first half compared with your expectation. How is it? The second half then, just getting going. Argentina clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the... Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. And he's had a hit! And collective relief etched on the faces of the defenders. He's having a go! A real 
off. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. just didn't work out for the run that he made. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. He's going for goal! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Uh, not enough accuracy on that pass. Challenge just to fit on the third side. Duly punished. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Argentina go into the lead. Look, he's the one everyone expects to put the ball in the net. That's what he's paid to do. The pass has gone astray. Too much on that. It's gone out. McAllister. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Well, this defence now knows that they have to reduce his movement because they've allowed him to run free. Now the counter. Well, this man's contribution is, as you would expect, proving terrific. Having that sort of player in your side is reassuring because the rest of the team knows he can make his influence count at any stage. It's simply part of his package. When he really wants to, this fella scores. Di Maria. And the ball's come loose here. Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Up to meet it! It's in! And surely that does it! Perfect time! Decisive strike! Great corner, and he did the rest. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Well, oh, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. Take it off it, that's really well played. And that's a foul, free kick's been given. Hendra is cut out. Disappointed with that. Mm -hmm. 
it'll be a throw in. Oh, he's picked out the runner. And that's it.